dear third semester vto students i welcome you all into my channel again hope you are all doing well so first of all let me tell you i have received a lot of feedbacks from the student side that they have written 90 marks more than 90 marks in dtco subject operating systems i wish you will also score in this data structures and application subject dsa right so i have taken here the super important questions for you guys and passing modules let me discuss over here okay this is some of the tricky subject so you should not leave the problematic part at all okay so for that i will also provide the papers psa papers on my instagram account no need to worry for the papers so bcs 304 is the subject code and here is the scoring package not only the passing package so you can go through these super important questions first of all the definite question that is what is data structure list and explain data structure operations and discuss four dynamic memory allocation functions with suitable example discuss self referential structures and uh, next one we have define arrays explain different types of arrays how can a one dimensional array uh, be initialized explain with example and explain with a neat blog systematic diagram different types of data structures with examples this is again a super important question differentiate between structures and unions shown examples for both define stack give the implementation of push pop and display functions by considering its empty and full conditions next one we have so there will be questions on post fix or sometimes in fix so no need to worry about the problematic part i will provide the previous year papers uh, you can go through these post fix problems next one we have give the triplet form for given matrix and, and also find its transpose so matrix will be given you have to just give the triplet form for that particular matrix and also transpose and what do you mean by the pattern matching outline these are three types of pattern matching algorithm all right next one we have defined pointers give advantage and disadvantage of pointers how do you declare and initialize the pointer how do you access the value pointed to by a pointer okay next one we have what is recursion give two conditions to be followed for uh, successive uh, working of recursive programs write a c recursive program to solve the tower of hanoi problem make sure you will go through these super important questions surely you will get 20 marks okay provided to the condition you are going through sparse matrix problems and also post fix problems right now coming to the model second again a passing module in which you have to go through these super important questions like what is the advantage of circular queue or ordinary queue discuss the implementation of circular queue operations demonstrate multiple stacks and queues with examples uh, explain linked stacks and queues operations give the c functions for the following on singly linked list with example uh, insert a node at the beginning delete a node at the front and display define queue discuss how to represent queue using dynamic arrays what is a linked list explain the different types of linked lists with neat diagram seventh one we have give the structure definition for singly uh, linked list write a c function to insert on element at the end of a single linked list delete a node at the beginning of sll right next one we have distinguish arrays and linked lists explain advantages of circular lists with respect to other lists ninth one we have write a c program to implement insertion deletion and display operations on a circular queue uh, next one we have uh, the problem I already told you I will provide the previous year question papers by which you can uh, focus on the problematic part okay so no need to discuss over here even though I have taken here the problem sample right so next one we have module third which is again a passing module define linked list implement c function for the following circular doubly linked list insert a node at the beginning delete a node at the end display develop a function to delete a node whose information field is specified in singly linked list what is a tree with suitable example define a complete binary tree degree of the tree label of a node fourth one we have list and explain representation of a binary tree discuss how binary tree are represented using array or linked list all right a c function uh, for the following operations on doubly linked list uh, addition of a node and concatenation of two uh, doubly linked list uh, write c function for the following operations on circular linked list inserting at the front of a list finding the length of a circular list seventh one we have discussed in order pre-order post order and label order traversal with a suitable recursive function for each and also you have to go through problems related to it right practice problems related to it from previous year question papers which i will provide on my instagram account emotionally 14 define threaded binary tree discuss in threaded binary tree with an example describe binary tree level order traversal write the c function to perform binary tree level order traversal right and problems on binary trees you should surely go that is in order pre-order and post-order this will definitely help you in acing 
the DSC subject if you just go through these modules fully you can easily pass the subject and if you want to score then definitely you have to refer another two modules which I have taken over here that is module 4 write a function to perform the following operations on binary search tree BST inserting an uh, element into BST recursive search of a BST right next one we have for the given data it is again a problem sample over here which I will not discuss list and explain the common operations of binary search tree define graph explain graph abstract data types explain the elementary graph operations explain about forests discuss selection trees with an example and seventh one we have explained transforming a first into a binary tree with an example define the following terminologies with examples digraph we hit graph self loop parallel edges degree of a node uh, and uh, sixth one we have complete graph directed graph subgraph and multigraph so these are the simple definitions which you have to go through next one we have obtain depth first search and breadth first search traversals for the given graph graph will be given in the problem for the problematic part again i am repeating practice previous year question papers and also model paper right next one we have model fifth in which you have to go through these important questions like define hashing explain types of hashing functions in detail explain static hashing and dynamic hashing in detail write a short note on leftist trees optimal binary search tree priority queues what is collision what are the methods to resolve a collision explain linear probing with an example discuss uh, avl tree with an example write a function for insertion into an avl tree sixth one we have defined red black tree split tree discuss the method to insert an element into red black tree uh, what is an optimal binary search tree obst explain the concept of search cost in the context of optimal binary search trees how is the cost calculated what is the time complexity for constructing an optimal binary search tree using dynamic programming and last one we have explained static and dynamic search keys in obst practice problems from previous year question papers and model paper so only it is possible to score more than 90 marks in this particular subject once you go through the problematic part also so first of all try to cover these all theoretical portions later on you can go through the problematic part which will definitely help you in scoring this particular subject so i wish you all the best for your examinations dear again so make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates thank you so much